What is that? It's a big potato. What is that? I thought it was cool, but my brother thought it was fake. It's as real as you want it to be. So big. What is that? We came to see the big potato because I thought it was cool. The Ward brothers were among many children, along with their parents who passed through DAPS in Stewart's draft Wednesday. Jaden and his brother Peyton made personalized potato heads during one of the many activities featured at the Big Idaho Potato Truck Party. The DAPS Potato Party was from noon to 4 p.m. Well, I have been riding around with this supersized spud for three years. This is my third tour. Jessica Colthard is a brand ambassador for the Big Idaho Potato Truck. Colthard says watch people's response to the massive potato is the best thing about touring. It's just seeing people's reaction when they see a four-ton tater roll up. It's crazy. People like to snap photos, touch the potato, see if it's real. According to her, they tour for six months per year. We go to different festivals, parades, and we also stop at restaurants like Daps. The crowd size fluctuated throughout the day. By the end of the event, DAP's owner, Phil Wittry, says thousands stopped by to see the big Idaho potato truck. It's an annual trek here before they stop up at the um, Memorial Day Parade up in Washington, D.C. And they've been so kind to come by and see us the uh, last three years in a row. While DAPS is known by teenagers for its ice cream and burgers, the community has transformed the ice cream parlor over the years into more of a family restaurant. This has been a great community for us here in uh, Stewart Strat. Uh, we do a lot of work with all the local schools and everything. We have uh, fun nights for them and uh, <clears throat> take care of, uh, do uh, parties for the people. They have birthday parties inside. Uh, we help support the, the ball teams in the area, the baseball teams, football teams. Speaking of community, the vice chair of Augusta County Board of Supervisors, Carolyn Bragg, stopped by to take a peek at the potato. It's an exciting day in Stewart's Draft. It's always fun and to come out and support our community, small businesses. And uh, this is just a great event. It's exciting to see this giant potato come into our community. <laughs> Sorry. Um, so, um, you know, we encourage people to come out and look at it. And like I said, uh, you know, DAPS has, has this, I think this is the third year that the potato has been here. And it always has a great turnout. And people, the kids come and they love to have their picture taken with it. Bragg says the big potato event is an example of life in rural Virginia. This is what small town USA is about. It's about supporting each other and, um, you know, being excited about what other people in the community are doing. Surprisingly, it is a woman hauling around the massive potato. Melissa Bradford has only been on the job as a driver and brand ambassador for four weeks. Bradford says potatoes have several nutritional values. They are certified healthy by the American Heart Association. The way that they're grown in Idaho by all of our awesome farmers up there, it just, it makes me so proud. In Stewart's draft, Elaine Ragley for Breaking Through News.